Well, hello everybody. This is Brandon with Stardog's Boneyard. If you're new to the channel, we do everything Jeep. We try to build them right. We enter them into car shows sometimes. And hey, look, one of ours won recently. That's kind of cool. This was 86 Comanche, but uh, this is me. Uh, that's what I look like. So if you ever watch the videos and kind of wonder, well, there I am with a cool mustache. Um, we are building a 230 Tornado engine, and this video is uh, about that engine. One of the weird things about it is the flywheel, this thing, um, with all of its weirdness, doesn't fit into the bell housing once you install the bell housing, and it's just kind of a backwards way of doing it. Uh, lots and lots of stuff on the forums about it, but you can see, you kind of try and put it up there, and uh, it'll scratch against it. You can see where he scratches. So you could uh, technically take off some material from the bell housing. I didn't really want to do that. Uh, there's multiple methods of thought. Uh, one, people will uh, cut the teeth of the flywheel a little bit to make it fit a little better. Um, other people use what is called a tap back method or something like that. I don't know about it. Other people, like me, uh, make a fancy tool. So here's a 5 8 wrench. You cut it in half and uh, make some other bits to be able to create a, a fun little tool. Uh, it does require some welding, but essentially this is the pre-weld layout. Um, you know, that's, uh, that's what it looks like. So you can reach in behind the flywheel and uh, between the flywheel and the engine and, uh, and turn, some uh, turn some bolts. Yeah, so uh, here we are. Well, now that was exciting, but uh, this is the finished product. We got a really, really nicely booger welded together custom tool that allows you to reach in between the flywheel and the the engine block. So uh, this is kind of me um, kinda sh trying to show the situation there. But uh, you have to loosen the fly, or you have to loosen the bell housing from the engine block in order to be able to to get enough room to put the flywheel onto the bolts. Um, so yeah, interesting little tool.